Hi everyone, this is Ramesh from Java Guides. In this video tutorial, we are going to discuss four different ways to create objects in JavaScript. And here are the four different ways. So first way is using object literals, and second way is using constructor function, third way using object or create method, and fourth way is using JavaScript class. All right. So first way is using object literals, and using object literals is the simplest way to create object in JavaScript. And let's go ahead and let's create examples to demonstrate each of them so let's go ahead and let's create a object using object literals so I'm going to create a user object here and here I'm going to define some attributes first name Ramesh and last name for the three okay and here i'm going to define one more attribute that is email id ramesh at the rate gmail.com all right and here i'm going to define one more attribute age 29 and object can have also methods right so let's define our method here get full name and this is the function so use function here and we just want to return this dot first name and give a space here and this dot last name so this is how we create a javascript object using object literals and let's go ahead and let's see how to use this uh, object so just we are going to log this object and here what we will do we will call some of the its attributes or methods like this console.log inside that we are going to just call user dot get full name method okay so this is how we create a javascript object using object literals and here we are going to use uh, this object literal here okay so let's go ahead and let's run this javascript snippet so go to the terminal new terminal and make sure that you have installed node.js because we are going to use node.js to compile and run javascript code here in a terminal just type node and name of the file is demo.js file and here i am going to enter so look at here uh, we have uh, provided a console.log here and that is printed here okay and here we have printed uh, user object and here is the uh, function user dot get full name function okay so this uh, this way using object literals uh, you can use whenever you have a, one or two objects okay if there are many number of objects then this is not a appropriate way to create objects okay so if you are, if you are able to create a one or more uh, one or two objects then this is fine if you have multiple objects with the same type then you can can use a constructor function so let me show you how to create object using constructor function so before that one more thing is uh, if you don't have node.js then you can also you know execute this javascript code using a browser for example open a chrome browser like this and go to the console and here just paste this code and here we go just enter it and you can you can able to see the result of this javascript code here this is the user object and this is the uh, get full name method okay the result of get full name method so this this way you can also uh, execute a javascript code using browser great now let's see how to create object using constructor function so here i am going to you know define a constructor function function user so make sure that you use a upper camel case letter naming convention and here I'm going to pass a first name last name and email ID and age okay and inside that I'm going to just use post name equal to post name this dot last name equal to last name this dot uh, email id 
equal to email id this dot h equals h so this is how we create a constructor function with the same type that is user is the type now let us go ahead and let's create an object of this constructor function by using new keyword all right so let's create user uh, let user1 equals new user and just pass our values to the constructor here first name last name and just email id email id as ramesh at the gmail.com and pass age here okay so this way you can create object using constructor function so now let's print this object to the console user one okay so pretty simple right so let's run the pro let's run this javascript code and let's see the output so look at here so before that let me comment out the existing code here and let's run rerun the javascript code so look at here user object is printed to the console so using constructor function uh, you can create as as num as many as objects uh, just using new keyword for example so user 1 user 2 user 3 all right and you can pass a different users like a b c you know d x y like this okay and uh, so this is a convenient uh, way to create if you have requirement to create a uh, mini object then you can go with this solution okay so let me rerun so here we go all right so this is the another way to create a javascript object using constructor function now let's go ahead and let's see how to create a javascript object using object dot create method so let me comment out this so objects can be created using object dot uh, you know create method so this method can be useful because it allows you to choose the prototype object for the object you want to create without having to define a constructor function so let me show you how to create a prototype object of the uh, you know original object for example here we have created a javascript object using object literals like so let me copy this code and let me paste it here so here let's create a javascript object using object dot create method i am going to call this object as user1 and object dot create and here i am going to pass a user object all right and here i am going to print this user with some attributes like first name console dot log and here i'm going to use user one dot last name and here user one dot get full name all right so let's go ahead and let's run this code and let's see the output yeah here we go so output is printed on a console so this way we can use object dot create method to create an object that has a specified prototype okay so we are going to create a prototype object of the original object like this by using object dot create method so the final way is using uh, javascript classes so in javascript version 6 this is introduced classes are introduced so let's go ahead and let's create a javascript class to create an object so before that let me comment out this existing code and now let's go ahead and let's create a javascript class class and i'm going to give a name as employee or let's keep a user as a class name and here we define a constructor and inside a constructor let's define some of the attributes like first name first name comma last name comma email id okay and age all right so in a constructor let's define first name equals first name and this dot last name equals last name and 
this dot email id equals email id and this dot age equals age okay so this way we can create a javascript class and here we are going to uh, you know uh, provide some methods like get first name so this will return a first name uh, return here return this dot post name and let's go ahead and let's um, let's imp let's provide one more method let's let us name it as get last name and here we provide a return a return this dot last name all right so we can create a javascript class with some attributes and constructor and here are the few methods so let's go ahead and let's create an object of this class here i'm going to create let user1 equals to let's use a new keyword to create an object and here we need to pass a values to the constructor first name last name as for the array and let's give a email id as ramesh at the red gmail.com and give age as 29 okay great so this way we can create a javascript object using javascript class and let's go ahead and let's log this object to the console user1 and let's run this code yeah here is the output all right so this is a very important uh, you know to create a javascript object using class so it internally uh, uses a constructor function and classes are just you know uh, just uh, you know classes provide just a template for creating uh, objects but behind the scene uh, class javascript classes uses constructor functions okay so these are the four ways to create uh, objects in the javascript so if you have uh, any another ways or another approach to create a javascript object then let me let us know in the comment section so that everyone can refer it all right i hope you find this tutorial useful Thanks for watching, I will see you in the next video.